Hello everyone. Heartland Season 16 Episode 10 left us shocked and rooting for more. Jack was hospitalized after an accident, well, a murder attempt, at Tim's rodeo showcase. Tim's old friend Mike, who we saw in this season's fourth episode, returned to take revenge on Tim, but the victim ended up being Jack. As part of the showcase, Tim was going to ride a bronc in front of everyone else. Before the show started, Jack was helping Tim to get on the bronc, but the horse was uneasy, to say the least. He threw both Tim and Jack onto the ground, but Jack was the one who got heavily injured and was hospitalized as a result. It turned out Mike put a few rocks under the horse's saddle to make him uneasy, and that's why the horse became irritated when Tim got on him. So that's how episode 10 ended as we were left with many questions, the first of which is about Jack. Is he going to live? When will we get an answer to this question is the subject of this video. Well, as it's the end of the year and we're into the holiday season, the effects of this time can also be seen on TV shows' schedules. Starting this week, Heartland will have a winter hiatus, meaning no new episodes will arrive at CBC for the following weeks. Unfortunately, there won't be a new episode this Sunday and the next weeks until 2023. However, this break won't be long. Episode 11 of Heartland Season 16 will air on CBC on Sunday, January 8, 2023. Then the season will continue with its next episodes without any other breaks. This means that Episode 12 will air on January 15, Episode 13 on January 22, Episode 14 on January 29, and the final episode of the season, Episode 15, on February 5. You may also wonder about what we'll see in the second part of this season. We have a brief preview for Episode 11 that gives us clues about what we'll see. The preview starts with Tim and Caleb having a conversation. Tim talks about how the whole police department cannot find Mike and Caleb says they will find him and put him in jail. The preview continues with a rather violent encounter. Tim seems to have seized a man by his collar and almost attacked him. We think since the police cannot find Mike, Tim took matters into his own hands and started his own investigation. The man he is fighting with here could be someone who knows Mike and maybe where he is at the moment. The trailer also shows Katie and Amy. Both of them look really sad and about to cry. They are probably sad because of Jack's condition. Although we don't know yet, his condition could be severe because his shirt was bloody when they took him to the hospital. We hope he overcomes this easily. To be honest, we really think that he will. Such an important character like Jack will not die mid-season, especially when Sean Johnston talks about Heartland as his second family. Johnston loves being on the show and repeatedly said he could stay on set forever, so we don't think Jack will die this season. In fact, many set photos prove that Jack will be alive at the end of the season. A post from Michelle Nolden, who plays Jessica in the series, is a great example. In the post, it's possible to see Sean Johnston and Nolden together. And in the caption, Nolden says she shot her last scene this season with Johnston, which means we will see Jack alive and well in the final episode of season 16. Although the preview doesn't give away much, there is also a possibility to see Georgie back in episode 11. We know from multiple set photos that Alicia Newton has been shooting scenes for season 16. Georgie probably comes back to Hudson to visit Jack in the hospital, and we believe she will stay for a couple of days to enjoy time with her family. What are your expectations from the rest of season 16? Have you been enjoying the season so far? Tell us what you think in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and share this video with your fellow Heartland fans. You can also subscribe to our channel to get the latest news about Heartland. See you soon.